tuned in to the best part. It's your boy Joey Truex. We are live in the building. Today's mathematics is wisdom culture, all born to the equality. And that is exactly what we're doing. We got the righteous people in the building. It's a legendary show today. Words can express, but actually words can express. Word is bond. Wisdom culture, the equality. The legendary God MC Rakem Allah will be joining us shortly. God is going to check in with Lexington, Kentucky. He's going to check in with the people. The tour, the book, the first visit to Lex, the history. It's so major. Arabian Rakim since 1986, official. They literally changed the game, turned the game upside down, lyrically. Rakim, it's just a great honor and pleasure. So y'all keep it locked. Joey Truax, WLXU, it is the best part. Is my heart racing right now? <laughs> I think my heart is racing a little bit. Yes, sir. I think that I'm like. That's uh, love, man. Thank you, man. Rakim, God, peace, God. Yes, sir. Peace, G. Peace. Peace, God. Um, I, I'm, I'm here joined by the righteous community of Central Kentucky. Um, your name is such a grand name, and. I had on the books uh, to bring one of the uh, Nation of Islam representatives, uh, the sisters starting the school, and we're all here gathered. Uh, if I had to physically go get some red carpet somewhere and roll it out, literally, I'm, I'm, we want to do it, Rakim. This is their first visit in Lexington. Uh, we're so yeah. excited, man. Now, you've been to Louisville, right, God? Yeah, I've been to Louisville a few years back, a few handful of years back, man, but I'm um, never there, man, so I'm looking forward as well. Hoping, hoping everybody out there is looking forward to it as well. Peace, peace. Eric B, peace, God. Peace, family. Man, I'm doing good, man. We, we are here. Man, world up. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Everybody is so excited. Um, appreciate it, man. Rakim, it's, you're, you're, you're more than welcome, man. We appreciate you taking the moment, man. And I did uh, have a... Obviously, I have to say peace to the nation of Islam and, of course, uh, the nation of gods and earths. There was a good brother... Uh, one of Brand Nubian's managers, uh, chosen few management, I mean exact, peace to the God. Um, he was, yeah, he, he was kind enough to uh, sort of lend me a little bit of info to try to get to you, and I'm very appreciative of that. Um, All right. God, I understand uh, that there is a book uh, documenting some things. Uh, it, would you care to enlighten us? I heard through the grapevine that Rakim got a book coming out. Wait. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I got a book coming out uh, shortly, man. I think it's September 24th. Wow. On the Wisdom, and, um, the wisdom Culture Day. Wow. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And um, the name of the book is titled uh, Sweat the Technique. And um, basically, the book is, is about encouraging people, man, to be the best they can be. Encouraging artists. Encouraging anybody that... You know, just need some um, aspiration or, or, you know, a little push, man. You know what I mean? I'm hoping that the, the book inspires people to be great, man. Word up. Allah, peace. Peace, All right. peace Allah, God. man. All right. No doubt, baby. All right. I'll tell you man. Spoke on the phone, right? Yeah, we did indeed, right. man. We did indeed, man. That, that, that was good, man. That was beautiful. Yes, sir, man. Appreciate the love. Indeed, indeed. Um, well, I, we, I can say from a personal experience, uh, when I was 12 years old, Rakim, at 1986, man, at the park with my older brother and uh, his friends here in Kentucky, this is obviously before the internet, before a lot of different, I think Video Music Box was uh, in its, uh, in its uh, early yeah, inception, sure. and we used to get the mixtapes uh, from New York City, KISS FM, WBLS, and when we heard... Eric B is president. I came in the door. This is something that turned the entire hip hop culture upside down. Um, we don't know where it came from because we were so used to the, you know, uh, jam on it, hoo ha, you know, the Melly Mel. Um, but you came out of Long Island with something that was so magnificent and it meant so much to us that, that words can't express. I mean, words can express on the Wisdom Culture Day, and this is the equality, but. You mean so much to the culture, Rock here, man, and, and I'm sure you've heard this before, but coming from uh, myself, Joey Truax, Yousef, here in uh, little old Lexington, Kentucky, we appreciate you so much. It means much. a lot, man. It means a lot. Like, you know, 
in the beginning, you know, and you know, sitting in in rooms by myself with with a notebook. You know, that's all I wanted to do, man. Um, I felt that getting out yourself and the things that I was into, I felt was very important. And all I wanted to do was just try to get as much of it out as I could. You know what I mean? Yeah, so to hear that, you know, I mean, I can hear it a million times a day, man. And it, and it's what keeps me going, man. So, you know, I appreciate it, man. And, I, and I'm glad that, you know, I was able to reach people in Kentucky, man. It's like, you know, it's, it, 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 in the book, I speak about things like that, man, trying to, um, you know, push myself to, you know, be all I can be and, and um, you know, how how I amazed myself by being able to inspire as many people as I did, man. So I appreciate the love, man. I count my blessings every night. Absolutely. And I look forward, man, to, to continuing it. Yeah, well. Lexington, Kentucky, Rakim. Uh, obviously, uh, I, could, yes, I, could, I would want to keep you for so much longer. I know you're moving to Shaker God. Uh, the gods and earths are looking forward to see you. Nation of Islam is looking forward to see you. No. No That's doubt, fair. no fair doubt. Fair. We're all looking forward. The equality is big down here, man. Obviously, uh, it's huge. And one more thing, Rakim, I just wanted to say about the equality, because this has always played on my heart and my mind, and I got you on the phone. God willing, inshallah, I'm going to see you. But, you know, on the record, follow the leader, um, there was t two people that had uh, transitioned or um, returned to the essence of. One was your father, your physical, but um, a lot of people don't know about the producer, um... Uh, what, what was the brother Paul C? You 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 chose yes, to put sir. Paul C on the back of your record. His face. A lot of people didn't know, you know, part and self. A lot of people don't didn't know who that Caucasian brother was and what he meant. Could you share yeah. with a little yeah. bit of info about Paul C and and what he meant to you? Uh, the fact that you put him rest in peace on the back of your album that was big, Rakim. And I, I just want to hear yeah. something about Paul C. Yes, sir. Um, I met Paul C at a real um a real, uh, I, I could say, testing time of my life. I was being put through a test. My father passed away, and I was real bitter with hip-hop at the time. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know if, you know, I, I, if it was so much being bitter with hip-hop or being that my father passed and I was so, you know, involved with hip-hop, I couldn't spend a lot of time with my pop when he was uh, sick. Mm -hmm. So when he passed, I didn't want to write, make a long story short. I didn't feel like writing. I didn't feel like listening. To, you know, I didn't want to do nothing. Mm -hmm. Canceled my tour to mm -hmm. Africa and sat, you know, for weeks on weeks, man, just, you know, thinking about, you know, what I'm going to do, contemplating. And um, I met Paul C. And somebody had been trying to get us together, man, for maybe two or three months before that. Mm -hmm. But I finally... Um, got in touch with him, man, and, and I sat down with him, and um, he invited me out to his crib. I went to his crib in Queens, and, and we sat down, and he started playing me some beats. First of all, I went to his crib, and, and he had the whole house lined with records. Man, <laughs> right. Right there. So, I mean, I was already impressed, and everything was, you know, in, 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 in rappers and plastic. But we sat down, man, he started playing music, and I was blown away, man. Wow. And the ghetto... The ghetto was like the first record that he played me, and oh, the sample, the, the sample joint. Oh my God, unbelievable! Yes, sir. Wow, yes, sir. you know what I mean? And he, he actually had it kind of sampled, just like the framework of the beat. Right, you know what I mean? And and when I heard it, you know what I mean? I felt like writing again. I felt like it was it was relevant for me to write, and I felt my father, you know, pushing me. Wow, that's that's unbelievable, man. I'm I'm just. Yeah, um, God, peace to the God. Uh, this is the best part, Hip Hop 101. Joey Truax with the God, legendary God MC Rakim. Uh, study your history. This is Hip Hop 101. You are learning. Paul C. was one of the legendary beat makers. May he rest in power. Uh, and just on this day, God, of, of wisdom culture, all born to the equality, we're dealing with the supreme mathematics of the gods and earths. Um, that equality, man, that you showed on that album with the Caucasian brother Paul C. and then your father, it's just so big. It's bigger than what I could even imagine. Rakim, we look forward to seeing you this Sunday at the Guard Hour, 7 o'clock, here in Lexington, Kentucky, man. Manchester Music Hall. It's going down, God. We appreciate you, man. We salute you, man. Straight up and down. Lexington, KY, you know what I'm saying? Syracuse in the building. You know what it is? Hood in the building. Right life, you know what I'm saying?
Bad news. Bad news. Bad news. Bad news, bad news is in the building. You know what I'm saying? So we, we out here. You know what I'm saying? Lexdown, Kentucky. And they coming down from Syracuse. Getting it in with the guards. Best radio DJ is our next category. And the nominees are Kenny Cummings. Joey Truex. 